Jacks in new. Ooh, Plus. the full hole taking the advantage. All right. Hype mode is ready. And we're going. Hang on a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here whoa, we go. Hang on a minute. Mike Metroid, baby. We have Ermac. Wait, we can get another Ermac. He's going to do it. No. No way. There no it is. No way. Are you serious? Hey. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Good Lord. That was the combo of the tournament. Easily. I love you, Shujinko. Ah, what are you doing? Four or something with loads of chip damage. And that's plus four with Johnny Cage. Johnny Cage with torso spin that ain't even going to be fair and i've never seen it in but action. at the same time i just know it's going to be bad like so good yeah but i mean like yeah, we, we go way back with mike mike's been around for a very long time if you've been around in competitive mk you know, you've probably bumped into him at an event here and there on the flip side however beyond toxin not a new face to mortal kombat by any means uh, but has been so successful in the shorter amount of time that he's been playing has been looking pretty much unstoppable with the ermac so far uh, we know he has that amazing Havoc too, but really looking comfortable on the Ermac today in particular. All right, Shujinko is fully loaded. Everything that Shujinko is going to do here, though, is going to be generally tied to landing the hit. The exception of being green mode. Oh, no punish, though. Oh, big down, too. I tell you, this guy's playing Mortal Kombat. 1990s Mortal Kombat. Those, those uppercuts are, like, so synonymous with that. Now, Beyond Toxin gets the knockdown. Let's restand. Ooh, that was wake up micro dash forward into standing one. Mike Metroid. Escape failed. He did try in tech, but didn't have the right direction. Oh, punished. Oh, that's damage. Oh, yeah, he's going to regenerate. Shujinko, by the end of this combo, is going to be completely back. Even though you dropped it, who cares? But look at all the meter Toxin lost for that, though. No meter to extend. Has to just take the safe jump. Mike Metroid challenging the safe jump though and will pay the <laughs> price. Toxin saying, hey, you can take my meter, but I'm taking your life. I'm taking the round, mate. Oh, there's the catch. Nice. Where are you going? Mike Metroid's being a little bit disrespectful with his own frame data at the moment. Oh. Oh, big whiff punish. Oh, there's the lift. More of the hype mode build. And now actually hype is ready. Jinko's back. Punish. Ooh, hello. I didn't even notice we got a side switch there. Toxin was ready though. Toxin knew. Ooh, Plus. the full hole taking the advantage. All right. Hype mode is ready. And we're going. Hang on a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here whoa, we go. Hang on a minute. Mike Metroid, baby. We have Ermac. Wait, we can get another Ermac. He's going to do it. No. No way. There no it is. No way. Are you serious? Hey. Uh, 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 uh. Good lord! That was the combo of the tournament, easily! I love you, Shujinko! Ah, what are you doing? That was Stay there! Sick. I didn't tell you you could leave! Oh, that nod to the camera, Mike. He knows he just popped off. He knows he just popped that off. That was the combo of the tournament. Absolutely. That was too sick. Oh, muscle memory there. Toxin tried to punish it with a sweep. Read the patch notes, bro! Oh, again, tried to whiff punish, but no commitment this time from Toxin. Oh, that time he will. Didn't work last time because he was cornered, but it will now. Yeah, that's one Was that full screen, like, straight up torn from that Mike? Is Mike Metroid, like, if you go on his social media, he posts so many Shujinko Johnny combos. Like, he loves the hype mode. Like, that's his favorite thing to do in this game is hype combos. Oh, no cancel there from Toxin. Oh, underneath. You can tell that Mike, he's fishing for a hit, but Toxin is not giving it. Uh, Toxin's defense is historically bare, like one of his best Ooh. things. Try to find it. Has to break now. Oh, this is going to be a hard... Oh, wait, no! He hasn't <laughs> got any health. He hasn't got any health. He just threw it away. All right, game one. Yeah, that was Mike doing a bit of a, a little bit of I can put that armor on myself, but didn't have the meter. To it's one of those. Armor. I'm a genius. Oh no, I have no meter. <laughs> I have no meter. He's gone. He's just disappeared. Hey, we can talk at length about Mike's uh, kind of dedication to this kind of team, but at the same time, we talk about Toxin here. Toxin is no player to underestimate, especially at the event scale of this. But look at the just utility. That's actually really impressive use of that lift because you get that guarantee. That they're stuck in the air for so long. You really can do whatever you want. So if you have like, a buff you can activate or something you can charge, you have so much time to do it. That's Toxin. His defense is one of the things that's just helping him out so much here. It's very hard for Mike Metroid to crack into him, really. Oh, and there it is again. 
Toxin getting so much mileage out of just one, two, three. Oh, oh caught the button. Four. And that's the round. Mike Metroid swinging a bit too hard at the moment. He's going for some really brave interruption attempts. And Ooh. Oh, I punished. Wow. Now, I mean, Mike Metroid, he does know this matchup extremely well. Pipe mode is activated now. So if you get hit, that's half life. Oh, oh didn't expect yeah. Toxin to drop the cancel. That's definitely not the break you want. You're considering there are so many of these situations that you're like slightly plus or zero. Toxin is finding the button a lot more. That, that is the exact kind of game that Johnny thrives at making the most out of. But Toxin is finding his opportunity to counter so much. Because all these instances, Mike straight up plus, and Toxin is finding a standing one out of it. So he's calling out, you are not going to enforce your advantage here. I know you're not. So I'm going to take my turn instead. A little bit of meter build. Yeah. Nice ender. Toxin, what's it going to be? Plus frames. Oh, chases him he down. He caught the back dash. Yeah. All right. That EX. <coughs> All right. It's so advantage. But that's why you're able to see it just chase down an entire back dash, right? You've got a lot of plus frames, a lot of mobility, and Toxin looking so good. I'm really happy that Toxin is, like, really sticking out with Ermac this time. Because, again, back at CEO, he did end up going back to Havoc because he was making a significant amount of execution errors. We are not seeing that Toxin today. Toxin no. is very clearly very prepared. And you love to see it because he's a player who has played at the highest level for a good number of years now. But we don't really see him too much these days compared to how often he used to compete. So when he does get the chance to show up, it's nice to see this level from him again. Lovely throw tech, actually, on that. Definitely try to whip punish. Shujinko getting kicked once more just before he charged as well. Well, go. the benefit of Meditate is that it's one of the few cameo moves that has three seconds of a penalty when it gets hit rather than six. All right, let's replenish. That's already full hype. Oh, Ooh. doing it meaty. Raw activation. And the patience from Toxin to wait out that Rising Star. Very respectful breaker there from Mike Metroid. But he's gone green. He's gone green. And he drops the combo. Takes the frames. Toxin would have had to flawless block that. No doubt he would have tried. But that's the first round on the board here for Mike Metroid. Representing Combat Network, by the way. Shouts to Combat Network. Oh, wow. That actually connected. Oh, big uppercut. Full combo, too. Not a huge damage, but... More than the default uppercut. There's the interruption. He was looking for it. Toxin. He's been fine. Like you said earlier on, he's been finding the buttons pretty consistently. Well, it's such a dangerous game to play because that is literally what Johnny does best. Those individual buttons. He's constantly plus, but always looking to, to catch you pressing. And Toxin, he's not pressing every time, but when he does press, he's got a real good success ratio of being the one that he comes off better in the situation. Looks for the whiff punish, but unfortunately walked right into an overhead. Pipe mode built. But there's, there's no meter to take, so that Death's Embrace isn't really doing much. Yeah, there's the catch on the overhead. Toxin manages to find it. Probably going to be enough? Yes, more than so. And Toxin, match point. Toxin looking good. Now Mike Metroid is still in this, but it's going to be difficult. He's got to regenerate Shujinko. Gonna bide his time while he waits. Oh, definitely wanted to think walk up grab was coming. There is a grab, but it's beyond toxins. Oh, actually opted to forego the combo in terms of some pressure. An interruption attempt, whatever it was. Might have been a parry, perhaps, but it didn't work. Oh, big jump from Mike. Oh, so many of these trades. Gets caught by the mid again. Mike Metroid has been getting hit by that back two so many times. And actually, that's going to hurt. Janet again. Finish it. Safe jump. And we tried. We tried something on wake up. Might have been a parry. Might have been something else. Either way.